Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to add a payment gateway to SWID. Uh, now, if you're using SWID for your e-commerce stores or maybe for your uh, dropshipping store, uh, well, this video is for you. So SWID is a really great uh, you know, platform when it comes to e-commerce. Um, as you can see, they have a lot of different things that you can incorporate. And obviously, if you wanna go and add a payment gateway, it's very easy, right? So what you wanna do is, as you can see, once you're on Etsuit right here, you have payment right here on the left side, you just go to the payment and then here uh, you can click if you want phone order, order or not, you can activate this as well. And by the way, you can add Stripe, PayPal or Square. It can be set up by clicking the blue button on each of these sections. So as you can see, you have connect with Stripe. This is exactly how it will be with Square. Now all you have to do is connect with Stripe and that's pretty much it. You'll need to go through the uh, entire connection process. Now, obviously, if you want to set up other payment methods, you can scroll down to the bottom of the page where there is a section to add offline payments such as bank transfer or cash on delivery. Um, I'm not sure if you can add crypto as payment gateway for now, but this is how you can do it uh, within the backend. So this is when we're talking about adding a payment gateway, this is just in the backend. Now, obviously, uh, as you can see, you can also add new payment uh, methods by going to payment, add new payment methods. This is what we showed you, right? And then obviously you can choose a payment system from the recommended payment options. You can also scroll to more options to accept online payments and click choose payment method drop down to choose other payment systems as I showed you previously. Now also you have appearance options here. Uh, this is display name and checkout. You can enter the name under which the payment method appears uh, to customers when checking out. So uh, again, this can be like uh, any name, right? You can show a checkout setting. You can enable this as well. So that's pretty much how to set up an SWIT store and how to set up a payment gateway more specifically. Uh, if you have any questions or maybe comments that are specific, uh, then definitely comment down below. We will see you in the next video.